this bag won't stop making noise. Well, I hope the mic doesn't pick it up. <sighs> Hold on. Oh, excuse me. All right. <sighs> there we go. I'm all set now. That was a long preamble for nobody. Challenge start, diverse world. Here we go. Prompting, or, or deciding, I should say, not to really do any other um, theme map this time. But just like any other time, if you have a suggestion for a map you would like to see me try, you go ahead and put them in the comments below there, and I will look at it. Don't be shy now. You could be like, hey, I wanna, I, there's a map I made that's all about people's shoes. Can you do that? I would, I'll look at that one. I'm not really guaranteeing that, number one, it'll be very interesting. Number two, it'll be uh, worthwhile, but hey, I'll, I'll give it a shot. I will at least look at it. I can give you that. Uh, if I don't you end up using it, I will definitely tell you. And I'll probably give you a why, because... It's all about shoes. I don't even know if that's really a feasible um, map type to do. But hey, um, I'm sure there's weirder maps. If someone was so inclined to do their due diligence to be like, here's every uh, instance of a guy, you know, peeing on the side of the road. I mean, there was that one... Uh, Map. I've mentioned it a couple of times. I believe it was someplace in uh, Argentina where a guy was just right on the side of the road taking a big piss. And I don't know if it was censored. I think it was. Um, so if someone was so inclined, they probably could go ahead and make it. As far as this one goes, I have very little idea as to where this is. Um, this is tropical. This makes me think this could be Central America and or Brazil. This could be the Philippines. You know, there's a lot of potential here around the equator. And I don't know if I'm going to get any more pertinent information in the next minute 40. But here's hoping. Anyway, how are we doing? It's the middle of the week. I have way more energy now than I thought I did because I definitely didn't have this. All right, so San Juan. Bruxelles. I believe this is Central America. I am going to very much say this is where we are. Problem is, none of these have popped up yet, and I thought I would at least get one. So now I don't know how confident I am. Hmm. Well, let's uh, figure this out a bit more before we completely uh, throw in the towel here. Um, what do I have to update? We have ourselves. And as a URL, however, I'm not going to get close enough to actually figure out what it says, unfortunately. Uh, no, went too far. Went too far. Give me back there. Okay. Here we got. Here we got. Okay, this is probably all I need. P Pitalito. That doesn't help me. I don't know where... Oh, shit. I got 10 seconds. Um, Guatemala. I don't know if I'm going to get anywhere closer. I bet you this is probably, like, down here. But here we go. Yep, Colombia. Pito Lito. There we go. That one was a bit difficult. I feel like I'm rambling or meandering more than usual here. I'm trying to be a bit more focused, but this is Scandinavia, or at least Northern Europe. I don't know where yet. I um, feel like I have a lot to want to get through here. Um, we did have a stream on Sunday. Um, audio level's a bit fucked, but again, I'm still working on it. 
uh, as far as the game I was playing. I don't know how much more uh, Final Fantasy fourteen I want to mess with. Like, I always have this problem, and it's a problem with a lot of people who play MMOs and then stop. It's it's that there there's this saying that they always say that you know it'll never be like the first one you played, and you always hold such hold hold such high reverence for. Suits shorn. You always such hold such high New Zealand. This can't be New Zealand. This is not New Zealand. Don't be dumb. Uh, whichever one was your first year, I was like, oh man, that was so fantastic. And it's not so much the uh, game you're referencing. It's the nostalgia and the feeling you had playing it and how fantastic it was. And it was like, oh my god, it was so much fun. But, you know, you did quit for a reason. And you're always chasing that dragon. Sap Mirstereg. Okay, this feels... Uh, we're up here, I think. Um, but I'm also still kind of... Eh. Like, there's some other things that came out as well. Outer Worlds is amazing. I've been hearing all sorts of things about it. Um, might dabble into that. I got control to still work through. That was still interesting. I just, I, you let go of something for a while and then you just kind of forget what you were doing, which is always a problem with me and games. Uh, no, I want to go over here to see this sign, please. NL. All right, we got it. We're in Northern Lion. <laughs> Look at me. I'm funny. But, um, I think I'll probably do some more Sunday stuff, whether or not I'll do any more, uh, who knows. It's not so much a work in progress as it is just a thing I like doing for the time being. Who knows how long I'll do it for. There's a, there is a Sapmir Nord. There is an expiration date on everything and everything you do. You know, you like some, doing something for a very long time and eventually you just get tired of it. And you want to move on to something else. That's just how life is. I mean, you could always think about things that you thought were fun when you were, I don't know, five years old. You love doing them, but eventually you just kind of got tired of it. And eventually that'll happen with a lot of things you do. It's not a bad thing. It's just something that happens. And right now I kind of enjoy hiking. Um... At least playing 14 for a little while now. Uh, I like doing GeoGuessr here. I've been doing it um, next month. Like maybe the 12th or 17th, somewhere around there, will be two years straight of, uh, well, not straight so much as it was me. Uh... Wait, we're on this side road now? This is weird. Um, two years straight of me doing this, give or take. A uh, busted collarbone in between here and there. That's an interesting flag. Um, I mean, I still consider things to replace this if I ever do feel like, uh, stopping. Oh, God, now I finally have information I need with five seconds left. The A7. A7. Oh, we were over there. So I was kind of closer before. Whatever. I do what I can with what I have. This feels Midwest. Uh... Potentially, before I even completely make the guess, like this region, this also could be Argentina. But we continue on. Like, uh, I've got my book. I finished uh, Handmaid's Tale. It's all right. It's okay. Well, this doesn't help me figure out if this is uh, the U.S. or not. I mean, this could be Australia, South Africa as well. Um, I got my book set for next um, next month, uh, The Anguish of Snails, which is a weird title for a book, but it all has to do with uh, clay cliffs. Hmm. It has to do with, um, I believe it's Western American, Native American folklore. So. I mean, to me, that's interesting. To other people, that could be deathly boring. All right, so we're in a British colony here. 
I don't know which one now, though. Clay Cliffs. Maybe this will tell me. What do we got? That doesn't tell me anything. Uh, I'm a bit concerned. I'm not going to find out where this is. But hopefully something will... Holiday Park. Lake Benmore. So I'm adjusting. Going very far away to this part. Hoping that one of these signs will be a road sign. Like a highway sign, I mean. That is not what I need. If I had to guess between these two, I feel that New Zealand's a bit more hilly than Australia. And this seems to have seasonal signage, which makes me feel like... Well, if I actually knew anything more about... Yep, that feels like NZ there. If I knew anything about, like, uh... Foundings of things, maybe this would actually fill, help me out a bit more. But I know that these signs that are like blocked off like that usually are a indication of seasonal signage. And when it's not winter or whatever, they put the signs away, or it's a holiday type thing that's only important information for certain times of year. All right, man. I feel like I'm bigskyqe.nz, man. You really filled all the uh, check boxes for, I want to say New Zealand stereotypes, but come on. All you needed to do was just have dot sheep in there somewhere, too. Well, you got sheep right there, so I guess that's it. Um, What else we got? I feel like I've mainly mentioned everything here. Book's fine. Uh, the stream, I don't know if I'm going to do any more during the week. Uh, again, if I do, there will be announcements on the Facebook page. Um, let's see. That's kind of it. We're just floating along here. Very much Buscott Station backpack accommodation vacancies. I mean, we're in that that twilight of, uh, of fall now, all the fancy leaves are gone. I'm uh, really just looking... For, ooh, what did this guy do? Just really looking forward to winter at this point. Oh man, I kind of nailed it. I keep running out, like, not being aware of the time I got left. I'm only... Okay, this feels like Brazil. I'm only really looking forward to winter to see uh how badly i uh picked my okay maybe this isn't brazil i'm only worried about how bad my commute to work is going to be mainly because i've uh moved a pretty substantial distance away jesus power <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is great. Jesus Power Air, huh? Sounds like a sick-ass Tony Hawk move. Saloon cars, Korea cars, Land Cruisers, Tipper Trucks, Carter Piler. I mean, it's supposed to be Caterpillar, I think, but didn't work out all that well. Now, I don't have any idea where this is now. This is a uh, strange location. This road is, like, abnormally huge. Is this like an island? World of Life Community Held Nurture's Training School. Is this somewhere in Africa? I don't know. Can I... Maybe there's something on this truck? What's the sign say? Uh, we're not getting close enough to find out. Onward then. Let's see if anything else. We, we got taxi cabs here. I'm assuming these are taxi cabs. They got kind of got the yellow patches on them to make me feel like it is. Come on. What do we got? Oh, it went too far. Is this a Jesus sign again? Bridge Street Junction. That doesn't help me. Two minutes left, and maybe I should... Well, I think I'm getting into a city. Or a town. 
Hmm. All right, so oh, we got a lot of Union Jack here. Okay. But we're not driving on the British side of the road, so this is not South Africa. Why would you have the Union Jack there? Um, I don't know. Unless the guy was just a fan of Britain. I mean, he kind of had it stickered all over his fan. That doesn't really mean anything. Oh, come on, get over this bridge faster. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Why did we just like zoom so far? Jesus. Azuloanu. Oh boy, I'm going to get such a bad score on this one, I think. I got a minute left, and I think this is actually where I'm going to find my information here. We got to go back. One, and what do we got? Oh shit. Sea Turtle Conservation Area. This is in the. Huh. All right. This could be. Pacific Islands. Yaba, that doesn't help me. Everything is like perfectly spaced again where I can't... Um, it's too far away, but the next click is too close and I can't make it out. What do we got? No, 50... Shit. This is just going to be such a bad score. Um, um, I don't know. Um, fuck me, Grenada. All right, what did I get? Yeah, that was impossible. I don't, I don't even care. I don't want to look. We were in Ghana, huh? I had no idea. Like, maybe I thought it was Africa, but again, I, it was sea turtles. That one was hard. Uh, I'm going to have an atrocious score. Okay, now I feel like I'm in Monaco. Actually, I think I am in Monaco, and this is part of that sharp corner that the racetrack has. The Monaco Grand Prix. It'd be really weird if this actually turned out to be Monaco. I think it is, and I'm going to... I almost feel like my score is bad enough that what I'm going to do, so I can find Monaco, ah, there we go. That hairpin turn, which was right here. Is there another hairpin turn in here? I don't think there is. So what I'm going to do is, this is my guess. My score is bad enough that I'm not going to move it anywhere else here. Uh, is there anything else I want to mention just to wrap this video up? It's going to be a little bit quicker than normal. Um, no. Um, if I get this wrong... Should I punish myself by doing something? I don't know. Um, I mean, my score is bad enough not knowing Ghana. I'm just, like, so confident I think I nailed this here. If I get this wrong. I mean, I kind of just put my, uh, my, my own balls on the line here. I think I kind of have to do something. I mean, if I get this right, do I get anything other than satisfaction? I don't know. Hmm. How about this? If I get this wrong, um, I'll leave it up to you guys to uh, tell me what I got to do. I won't do anything like insane, but hey, you can, just like with maps and everything else I was talking earlier in this video, you can go ahead and suggest it. I'll be pretty lenient with a lot of the stuff I'll do. But, um, go ahead, tell me what I gotta do. If I get this wrong. I mean, my threshold for getting this wrong is if I... I mean, if I at least get Monaco, then, yeah, I think I got it right. So here we go. Okay. I did get Monaco right, so... We were off a little bit. I thought we were part of the Grand Prix. I'm still in Monaco, so technically I'm right. I guess I, uh, I guess I dodged a bullet, but I'm pretty confident in my ability there. That was cool. I mean, 
Ugh, those are terrible, but uh score wasn't too, too bad. I think I did better than I did Monday. But that'll do it. Uh, I almost know if, wonder if I should do this challenge thing again. Maybe come uh, Friday if I get something wrong. But anyway, for now, I'd like to thank you all for watching. And if you have any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, issues, suggestions, anything of the lot, just go ahead and put them in the comments below there. I will look at them and get back to you as soon as possible. Halfway through the week, you're almost making it. And for some reason now, my neck is really hurting me. I just like leaned back and then came forward. And apparently my neck was like, nah, man, that sucks. But whatever. Just keep exhaling and relax. Week's almost over. We'll see you back here on uh, Friday for another episode.